So I'm a little better. Got some movie reviews because now my laptop's cooperating. You know, uninstalled, reinstalled Windows 10. So it's doing better. So I got 5050. The thing is from 2011, I think. Let me check. Come on, man. Yep, 2011. Good. And the TMNT remake from 2014. Yeah, that fucking thing. So I finished 50-50. This is from three years ago that I watched 50-50. So it was, it was so good. I loved it. The la That's the last Anna Kendrick film I rented, and I ended up loving it for the whole story, not just her. Yeah, A lot of her stuff that I watched back then... I ended up getting absorbed into the whole film, not just for her role, which was nice. Uh, 10 out of 10. I also had a brutally cold, honest truth come to light. I know what part of me died five years ago. Yeah. I couldn't figure it out until... I couldn't figure out what it was until 30 minutes ago. I knew my persona had been shunned away. More depression and other shit were factors too, but that wasn't it. I knew I was afraid to date again because they might die on me. That wasn't it either. The brutally, the yeah, brutally cold honest truth is my inner kid died nine thirteen thirteen. Yeah, definitely. When you're in a relationship and you form a bond with that person, both your inner kids are in sync and you become inseparable. Mm hmm. Definitely. <sighs> that's what I have with Crystal, but since she's been dead, my inner child has remained so as well. Yeah, my inner kid's been dead for a while. He comes out now and then, but <sighs> not very much. That's why I don't want to date again. I miss being in love and all that, but I miss the inner kid connection the most. It's something everyone takes for granted, and once it's gone... You turn into an uglier version of yourself that you don't recognize anymore. Yeah, that's where I'm at. That's what I've that's that's what I've become. Odd part is I like it to an extent. <laughs> yeah, I do. But for now, I'm gonna watch 2018's The Predator and hopefully pass out. <laughs> so yeah. And I already reviewed that movie. That was good too. Uh yeah. So 50-50 was good shit. I enjoyed that. But yeah, that was that cold hard truth that came out. <sighs> Rough. So the TMNT remake from 2014 was okay with its many sex references. The new storyline was eh. Karai was underutilized. Fight sequences were pretty cool. The three movie tie-in was weird and dumbed down for kids yet had a 90s-esque feel by the plot. Overall, I give it 2.9 out of 5. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. For, yeah the the storyline was eh, cramming the original three into one film was stupid. Oh, that was so stupid. Kar yeah, Karai was way underutilized. Fight sequences were cool. I did like those. Um... But yeah, the whole thing was dumbed down for kids. <laughs> Fucking news. And it definitely did have a 90s kind of feel to it, but not very much. But yeah, it's alright. It's not the best. Could have been better. Sequel was better. I did like Out of the Shadows. I don't remember when I watched that, though. I'll have to hunt that down in my thing and do a review. But I did watch that. So, between these two, which one was the better choice? I'm going to go 50-50. I mean, Turtles is cool and stuff, but honestly, that remake just... Yeah, don't sit with me that well. It's not one of those that I'd want to uh, own, honestly. Because even when I rented it, I rented the uh, standard definition version. <laughs> Yeah, it was like $4, too, back then. That was eight years ago. Yeah. So, if you don't like Turtles, you don't like comics, you don't like remakes, you don't like Anna Kendrick, you don't like psych films, that kind of shit, not for you. 
But if you do, you'll enjoy these for what they give you. Um, will I get 50-50? I don't know. But that was a good trio, though. Seth Rogen. I almost said Josh Rogan. <laughs> Joseph Gordon Lovett, Seth Rogen, Anna Kendrick. Good shit. Yeah. And also, I like, uh, what else was he in? Don John. That's another good one I enjoyed, too. I haven't watched that in a while, either. <laughs> that was good. But yeah, TMNT. Trash. <laughs> yeah. So, that's what I got. But I'll be back with another one. Stay tuned.